what is going on and welcome back so I realized that for the past two maybe three episodes that my mic icon wasn't lighting up like it was supposed to so therefore I was not gracing you with my beautiful voice so quick recap because uh, I did some stuff off screen so we I kind of the, the direction I'm going with this is kind of like a strength pyromancy build somewhere in that area, but you can't respec on the original Dark Souls, so the dex points are just kind of whatever. So we went and farmed up a man serpent greatsword. Now this took me uh, quite a while, a couple hours, to finally get one to drop. Because I don't have any uh, discovery bonus stuff on. I used some of the souls that I got off of it. Off of farming the... I went and farmed the two right next to the bonfire in Sin's Fortress. So I haven't gone into Sin's... Well, I mean, technically I went into Sin's Fortress. I haven't gone into Sin's Fortress. So I farmed the two right there by Andre. Finally got one to drop after a couple hours. I used some of the souls off of it to buy a couple of Titanite shards to get it to plus five. The rest of it I spent on leveling up a couple times, and we also I also went down. I forgot I couldn't find um. Is it Koilana or Koilan? I couldn't find her earlier when I was down by the bell switch because it's behind a hidden wall. I was looking and I, I thought she was just there, but it's a hidden wall. I found the hidden wall. Um, I had enough humanities on me to go ahead and get that up to rank 2. Oh, does it go to plus 4? I don't, that's kind of, I don't know how the covenants work in this. Anyway, I gave her 30 humanity. I only got 4 left. And I got... I got the Great Chaos Fireball, and I got the Chaos Storm. And then I got from the egg guy down there, I got infected with the egg and sat around for a few minutes. And I bought these two off of him. I still have some souls left over. And then the rest we put over here in some points. See, we went... <clears throat> I got a bunch of attunement points. I need to get the attunement up to roughly 28-ish. I knocked the mouse off my desk. I need to get attunement to about 28-ish. Strength. Another thing I did. Before I jumped into the Chaos Servant, I went over and talked to Shiva, because that's where we left off with the uh, Forest Covenant. I went and talked to Shiva before I started on the Man Serpent Greatsword. And I bought the Demon's Great Axe, along with the Demon's Spear. Now, I, already, I was planning on getting the Demon's Great Axe. We were only like 5,000 short. I think it was 10,000. And then the couple of things I killed along the way gave me an extra 15. So I was just like, why not? Let's pick up the spear too while we're here. So I got the Demon Spear. And the Demon's Great Axe from Shiva before we uh, got out of that covenant. Now the plan is... We're going to use we're going to use the great axe as our heavy weapon per se, and we're going to use the yeah the demon's great axe, and then we're going to use the man serpent great sword once we get a couple more levels in it as our uh, light weapon per se, because I believe the great axes have the big heavy moves as like the ultra great sword. I could be completely wrong on that. I don't, I like, in none of the Souls games I've ever really messed with axes. That's the plan for that. Um, armor is just kind of, be what I swapped out for the Eastern Helm. It's a little bit better than a Gargoyle. We already have, well, it's not better than the Gargoyle, actually. The Gargoyle is 15 across the board. Or whatever, something different. And we picked that up at the, over there by Shiva, somewhere. 
Um, same here, same ring. What's our equip load at? We can be up to roughly 54, as long as we're under 54. Alright. <laughs> um, what else did we do? I think I put two points in the strength because that's what I needed for the Mancer from Great Sword. But it's not leveled up enough to be as efficient as the Claymore. Um, let's see, did we do anything else? I think that was it. I leveled up the Pyromancy Flame a little bit. Didn't level this up anymore. I haven't leveled any of the armor. Oh, the Grass Crest. This was, I, I couldn't remember where this was at. This was down by that Black Knight at the bottom of Dark Root Basin. I killed him and then picked this up. And then I got the elevator shortcut right there to Valley of, of Drake. <clears throat> which is where I picked up one or two of the humanities to give to the uh, Chaos Covenant. Chaos Servants. We still have the Undead Dragon down there, but I don't know how that's going to work out. I, did, I saw there was another item, so I ran all the way up to him and grabbed the second item, which I think was like a soul of a proud knight or something like that. I think it was one of these. And then I left the dragon. I didn't even mess with him. Uh, oh, cool, we got Esther stronger. I had considered, and I still might. We've got the Quaylag bowl. Maybe we could do her Fury Sword, possibly. I'm still on the fence about that. I saw a lot of people like the uh, Man Serpent Sword, which is why I went and farmed for what seemed like forever to finally get this bastard. I think <clears throat> we'll probably just stick with those two. Um, I don't have the old witch ring to go get the... You know, where, where are we going? We could be walking while we're talking. Let's see. Um, we've got Stiff over here. I guess we could save Stiff. Yeah, I guess we could go send Fortress, I suppose. Or Demon Ruin. Um... Let's go Sense Fortress. Because we got Fireball. That, the Great Chaos Fireball does a lot of damage. But it's not going to do us any good down there by Demon Road. Alright, so I don't have the old Witch Ring yet. Because I would like to get... Um... The Great Fire... I think it's Great Fireball. From Quailan. I think that's her name. Quailan or Quailan. I think it's Quailan. So that's why we're aiming for 28 um, for attunement. That'll give us enough slots to run Chaos Storm, which was the rank 2 for the Chaos Servant. Um, that's. So we got the shortcut to Eyes Lift, too. That's down. That's down. Demon Ruins, I think, somewhere. Because if I remember, you can get the, um, I don't remember what they're called. They're little torch bugs or something, and they drop the helmet. And you can trade that helmet to, uh, the crow for the old witch ring. It might be worth it. I don't thinking about it. Not trading it right off and going through the catacombs. We have, don't I have, I think we have the Astora Straight Sword, which has Divine on it, so it won't be doing a lot of damage. Let's see, 10, 10, 14, uh, do we need 14? Probably not. But the Divine damage on it will keep the respawning skeletons at bay. Alright, let's see what we Maybe we'll put the um the glow bug helmet, whatever it's called, put it on, go do the catacomb. 
And then drop it for Snuggly. I think that's her name, it's Snuggly, him, her, whatever it is. Crow. We're gonna call it Crow. Oh, you guys are good. Feels like we just met yesterday. We got greedy, we managed to survive. That's this. Oh, when I was going back down to the Shiva, I remember right at the bottom of the uh, elevator, you have the Firekeeper's soul tucked off on the side. So I picked that up. When I went down to talk to Quelan, it's in the bottom. I to look. I'm pretty sure it's Quelan. Went and talked to Quelan. I upgraded the Estes while we were there. That's all that I did. Paranoid because now I come across a mimic. But... Ooh, large titanite. We need that for the man serpent sword. <clears throat> I don't remember if there's a vendor that sells uh, the large titanite. Like there is in the other game. You sleeping? <clears throat> thinking about it, don't you get... Oh, we're going down first, I guess. Don't you get... set of silver knight armor that drops in an Orlando? I think it is. Oh, 
oh, this is the first one. I'm pretty sure that's how you tell the limit. Oh yeah. I don't know what these what are these drop here. Oh, oh, no. Lightning. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Forgot to set the bonfire by Andre. Isn't that quite unfortunate? At least it's not too far away. If you think about it, we ran right past the bonfire, too.
What is there over here? I knew it, but I had to figure out. I had to know what was over there. My curiosity was too great. Is that... Mm, oh, I feel like the one that was... The cage that was open right there was the elevator. I thought you came down from the elevator up top. That's probably not it. I wonder if I could have just ducked off over there anyway. expert at this if that shows. Try this. I'm gonna see if I can get off in the cage right here. You, you've got to. There's like no way. Oh yeah. Wait, no. Oh. Oh, hey, look, open. Was there nothing else over here? Alright. Oh wait. I am look I am a bright mold in this place is Oh well that was lucky I suppose. Also, in the time that I was talking to myself, I made some volume adjustment. Let's see if that helps. Alright, can we, let's get away from this boulder. How about that? How about dim app? Oh, there's nowhere to run over here, is there? I guess that means we can... I don't think anything is on this. Yeah, 
we hitting a little light on the poi. Right. through the door over here. That looks like another, a good spot to start another attempt next time. <laughs>